in this box is a trap that I made out of just plain timber with perspex and two little doors and inside is a wood mouse and wood mice and you have voles, wood mice and you have the common house mouse and a lot of people just see a mouse they just call it a mouse but this is different because these are pretty harmless and they're actually lovely but if you want to make a way to catch your mice and if you have a mouse in the attic and you want to catch multiple mice how you dispose of them and but when you get a, a wonderful little innocent little creature like this and they are a, a huge importance to the food chain to other animals that are out there so the good thing about this is it has a little door on each end <laughs> and I can let him go again and I can reset it and he was up in the attic and you can hear him scratching sometimes and if you just set one of these very easy to make but these are little hobbies you can be making on the side and I just used uh, what do they call these uh, strap things just electric oh electrical cables but anyway we're gonna let this guy off wanna have a look at him in the morning sun gorgeous We just said we'd take a look at him before he makes a run for the door. But this guy, I did not catch him outside. He was up in the attic, so I had to catch him and I'm going to re-release him. But they're very, very nice. And you can see the difference in, the, in a, the field mouse compared to the house mouse. They have a very long tail, they have very big ears, and their back legs, if you can see their back legs, they have big feet like that. Remind you of Sideshow Bob. Well, Sideshow Bob. They have white underparts and brown on top. Large eyes. But we're going to let this guy off. So let's take a look at him. Going about his business. Morning. Oh, look at the colours. Beauty. For people who appreciate and love things like this, and even if you don't, you have to admire. Just look at the little details. We'll just watch him for a minute because I think this is lovely. I'm going to draw back slowly and you see I put a little stick under just to hold up the door so we're going to set it up now and I'll get back so he can uh, scamper out scamper off and become someone's victim maybe a fox or a, a bird of prey no I don't mean a nun but anyway come on it really teach you about life's opportunities wouldn't it Fear is what can keep us away from an opportunity. Although it's at the end where it can't get out, the door where you can get out is your opportunity. But sometimes we gotta help in the opportunity to have these things and you gotta always battle against your fears. Go on. Ah, oh, nice! And that's basically a wood mouse and they're very very wonderful looking little things they're really really harmless they're not like the common the common house mouse where people are afraid and they do bring a little and they're classed as rodents and things like that but look just a basic basic homemade up down just go up up down go up up down and bait what do you put into these boxes well i tell you cheese doesn't really work they love peanuts because they're full of fat full of full of energy but one thing they do really love is chocolate and we're going to go have a look at another little uh, bowl that I caught in another one of these traps but a bigger trap we're going to let it of course this is a bigger box because I was told well somebody said to me I think there's a rat outside so I said I'd make a box big enough for a rat to go into now if a rat goes in It'll spend a lot of time scraping and scrapping, trying to get out. But this is basically just the exact same purpose. And inside we have a little bank ball. And these are lovely little creatures. But we're going to take a look at it before I let it off again. I can't really see in that end because it's all, it's all paint on it. And as you see, I put a stick in. And he's ready. Just give me a minute. And I'll go back down to the other end 
and out help. Choppity chop. That's called fear, huh? Opportunities like that. Same in life. Should I or shouldn't I? There you have two of uh, Ireland's rodents. There are a couple of human rodents that I uh, see around, all right? But anyway, really basic and they're fantastic. And not only that, you can catch multiple um, rodents if one desires. But you gotta check them um, regularly, every day, just to make sure. Because if you don't, they won't really feed if they're, when they're trapped like that because they're too afraid, and they, they'll die of starvation or dehydration or whatever. But anyway, uh, enjoy your day, and if you would like to, I make when I do make videos, I they seem to jump from one topic to another topic, and sometimes it just take the matter at hand. At uh, w what's the figari or what's the what's happened today it's just that the opportunity was there today for these mice so i said i'd take it but if you would like to subscribe to my youtube channel i've decided to go on maybe just do more videos just for youtube but i'd appreciate if people want to come on and subscribe on the youtube youtubers and things like that i'd appreciate it very much because great to get a few numbers up on that but anyway enjoy yourself who knows what the ne next topic is there are a few things uh, conjuring up in the mind. But anyway, stay safe, be good, indulge, educate yourself, read your books, listen to your good music, uh, fantastic classic music, music with melodies, music with good lyrics, all that type of wonderful stuff. Eat the good food, drink the good wine, and make the good times roll. You know.